Hi friends, welcome back. Um, in this video, we are going to learn about which extensions in Tableau, a new feature introduced from 2024.3 version. So, first, uh, let me connect to the data source. I'm going to connect to the Superstore. Uh, if you click here under the marks uh, drop down, you can see a new option called Add Extensions. If you click here, you will see one uh, window Add Extension. So from here we can add extensions. Um, we have three options to select: built by Tableau, Salesforce, and free options and sandboxed extensions. Uh, you can also add extensions from the downloaded files. This option access local with extensions. For now, I will select built by Tableau plus Salesforce. Select here. You can see the related extensions. In this list, I'm going to select Sankey. Once you select that, you can see the details about the particular extension. You can read about the extension here. And then, if you need this extension, you can just click on Open button. I have used this extension before, it is not asking to uh, permission. Using any extension for the first time, it will ask for you to agree and then to give access to the data. Uh, let's say I want to use one more extension. I want to use this uh, stream graph. And if I click open here, you can see this. Uh, option uh, allow extension this workbook contains the following network based extension which is a web application that expands the capabilities of tableau allow this extension to run now select ok so you need to select ok if you are uh, allowing uh, the data uh, okay. and click ok here Now I'm going to use Sankey. Uh, let's say I want to build uh, the Sankey diagram. Whenever you select a particular type of extension, you can see the options related to that particular extension. If you select stream graph, these options will change. If you select a Sankey, uh, the options are different. Okay, so you should know how to use the uh, each extension. I want to build the Sankey diagram based on the category and so I will drag the category to the level. And then that if you want to we need to have one more level. So I will add a segment. And then I will add the sales link between these two levels. So now you can see how data is flowing from category to the segment, and each bar size represents the amount of value. Now to add one more level, you can do that by bringing another field to the level. So we have three levels. You can always change the uh, order of these levels by moving these. Okay. Yeah, this is how we can use the extension. You can also format this extension, like you can reduce the size of this segment, you can size reduce the size of these bars, and a few other options. So, click on this format extension. Once you click on this format extension, you can see these uh, options related to this extension. You can adjust the width, you can adjust the padding, edge padding. You can also modify the behavior. For example, you want to show the null values also, uh, align it just horizontally. So, labels formatting. Can choose the colors. So 
this is how we can use this extension and uh, use extension syntax. And also make sure before uh, using extensions, you need to enable. Um, if you go to settings and performance, there is an option here. Set dashboard web view security. Make sure you have enabled JavaScript to use these web based applications. That's it for this video. If you like this video, please hit the like button and do subscribe.